Me and Paul are on our way to Idaho right now. Hey, it's me and Kate here. He calls me Kate because he knows I hate it. But we're on our way to Idaho. We're gonna look at, we actually have a lot of things to do while we're in Idaho. We're gonna look at some venues for a wedding. Yeah, we got engaged. Got engaged like two weeks ago. Not focusing. What day did we get engaged on? November. 25th, 26th, 28th. I think we got engaged on November 20. I think it was the 24th. Yeah. Yeah. It was the day after Thanksgiving. Two days after. Two days after Thanksgiving. I think we got engaged on November 24th. And today is December 6th. 7th? 6th. Today is December 6th. So we've been engaged for almost like almost two weeks. Um, so we're in Idaho right now. While we're in Idaho, we want to look at some wedding venues. We have like three, there's not very many options in Idaho Falls that are indoor, but we have like three options to look at. Um, so we're going to look at some venues. We're going to get started on my passport because tell me where we're going on our honeymoon. We're going to Cancun. We're going to Mexico. And I've never left the country before, so I have to start on my passport, and it takes a while, so we're just gonna start now. We're gonna start on my passport. We're going to like eat at some places to see like what kind of food we want at our wedding, like who we want to cater it. Um, we're gonna, we might meet with like the flower lady, the girl who's doing our flowers for our wedding. We might talk to her. My mom ordered some like cookies too for me to give to my friends to ask her to be my bridesmaids. They say like their name and then it says like will you be my bridesmaid and like they're really really cute. So we're gonna pick those up on Friday and then deliver them to all my friends. What else are we doing? We're going to my sister, my sister Cheers. We're going to her basketball game tonight and then we should have another basketball game on like Saturday that we're gonna go to. We're going to two games. Yeah. One boys, one girls. And two games. Yeah. One boys, one girls. Kyle's excited. Um, we're gonna decorate gingerbread houses on Sunday. We're going to... I don't know what else we're gonna do. But we're gonna get a lot done. It's gonna be very productive. So we left probably like two hours ago, almost. An hour and a half ago. So we'll be there in probably like two hours ish. We're running a little bit late because I um, forgot some stuff in my apartment, so we had to go back, but it'll be fine. <clears throat> you should tell the story if I can do this. We have a whole video of this. No, we don't. Like with my proposal? Sure, we do. No, but like this story, like from our side. two weeks ago we were with my family for Thanksgiving and I like kind of thought it was coming but like, I wasn't really sure like I hoped it was coming we'd already paid out the ring we already bought it we already paid for it so like I knew we had the ring but I didn't know if it was gonna happen or not and so we were with my family for Thanksgiving in Park City my family rented out a cabin in Park City and he was with us and trip was coming to an end it was like almost the last day and so I was you know get kind of anxious hoping it would happen Thanksgiving came and went the Friday after came and went and then Saturday came and you should say the like, kind went. you're doing great you got it you're doing great Saturday we woke up and my dad was like, we're gonna go see a BYU basketball game, which I thought was kind of random, because it's like an hour and a half away from where we're staying, but I was like, okay. Because BYU basketball plays in Provo, and that was like an hour and a half from where we were staying. 45 minutes. It was an hour. Heber said it's 45 minutes from BYU. It was kind of a long way to go for a college basketball game, though. Yeah. Yeah. So he was like, we're gonna go to the basketball game tonight. And I was like, okay. And then that night came, and Paul was like, we're gonna drive separately from your 
family. So I was like, oh, okay. So we got in his car. I didn't say that. Yes, you did. I did. Please. It's not important. Just continue. Anyways. I didn't say that. Just continue. Anyways, probably first. And we're like driving towards Provo where the basketball game is. And I'm starting to get confused because I didn't recognize where we were and I thought he was lost. So I kept asking him, like, where are we? Like, where are we going? And he was like, oh, we're going to the basketball game. I know exactly where we are, but I really thought he was just lost. And, um, he was really nervous in the car. We kept getting the stress farts and the stress burps. Yeah. He threw up in his mouth a little bit. <laughs> Literally threw up in his mouth. <laughs> and... And then we pulled up to this barn, and then I kind of knew what was happening, because obviously, well, no, before that he said, we're going to pick up the tickets for my sister, because his sister knows, like, you are a basketball coach, and so I was like, oh, okay, so we told him we were going to pick up the tickets from his sister, and that we were going to meet my family there, and then we pulled up to this barn, and then I pretty much knew what was happening, and it was his aunt's barn that was in Morham, which is like right by Provo. And we got out of the car and um, went inside the barn. It was like, there's pictures everywhere and it was lit up with like lights and had candles and flowers. I'm making that face, please. I feel like you've been making that face the entire time. So zero minutes. It's flashing zero minutes. I mean, there's no space for every heart. This is really bad lighting, but it's already darker. We thought it wasn't recording, so we had to go back and check, and then it was recording. So, um, I didn't know it, but like his parents had already come into town from Vegas, and like they set it all up for us, and it was so cute. And we walked inside, and then got down on one knee, started laughing, because it was just awkward. Like, you just feel awkward, I feel like. And he started laughing, and then I was actually crying, which kind of surprised me. I think it surprised you too. You didn't expect me to cry. No, I didn't. Yeah. Like, it wasn't like crying, crying, but like, definitely was a little misty eyed. And so then he said, Will you marry me? And I said, Yes. And his sister was like up at the there was like a second level of the bar and his sister was up there taking pictures and one of his friends from high school was like a, she's a videographer and she was there like filming it and so like it was just us when he proposed and then afterwards like all both of our families were outside of the bar waiting which I didn't know either and so then he like went and got them and like my parents and my siblings and his parents and siblings and like my aunts and uncles and grandparents and everyone came inside and his mom had like treats and hot chocolate and we all just hung out super cute super fun and that was pretty much it and afterwards we went and celebrated with his family we went to Chili's it's kind of like a restaurant we always go to Chili's so it was only fitting that we went to Chili's after we got engaged so we went to Chili's and yeah, so that was like a week and a half ago, and we just barely got our wedding, like the video that his, the videographer took of us, she just barely got it back to us today, so I'm probably gonna upload that, like probably right after this video, I'll probably upload this video first and then that video right after, tell them we're getting married. Uh, April 27th. We're getting married April 27th in the Idaho Falls Temple. We already called and reserved it, so it's happening, and yeah, but we're excited. We're still like two hours away, two and a half hours away from Idaho Falls, so um, yeah, we will um, update you when we get to Idaho. It's the next day now, it's Friday. We got to Idaho last night and then we went to a basketball game and then we just went home and went to bed pretty much. Out the next morning, we were trying to get my passport thing figured out. So we just went and took my picture at Walgreens and um, it's not my best picture. 
how they're falling out. You know, it'll have to do. So we just took that picture and now we're going to the courthouse to like fill out the rest of the paperwork and stuff or I don't know, whatever you have to do. And then after that we're gonna go pick up my brother from school and take him to lunch. And then we might meet up with his friend, possibly. And then I don't really know what we're doing after that. But yeah. Just left the courthouse. Why are you laughing? Just left the courthouse and got our passport. Feeling pretty accomplished. We got there and we had everything. We had my social security card, my driver's license, my picture, my birth certificate. We had the, um, it's called application? Application papers filled out. Thought we had everything ready and then time to pay for it. And she's like, you have to pay for it with a check. And I'm like, I don't have a check. Who carries checks around? And she's like, well, it has to be a check. So I had to call my mom who's at work she had to drive and meet us at the courthouse and write a check for us. So, yeah, that was kind of annoying, but we got it paid for and it's all done. So, I don't know how long it takes to like process and everything, but got that checked off our list. And then, since my mom was with us, she was like, well, I'll just come to lunch with you guys now. So, we're going to pick up my brother and then we're going to go meet her at this place called Rizzo's Pizza. That's like one of those places that we're thinking of having cater a wedding. It's like a, a pizza place. What? Rizzo's Pizza, it's a, it's a pizza place. We're going to Rizzo's and, well first we're gonna pick up my brother and then we're gonna go meet my mom at Rizzo's. What? Should we tell them what Rizzo's is? It's a pizza place. It's our pizza. He's very rude to me most of the time. Anyways, keep you updated. Here's my brother. Aww. Welcome. What's up, poop stain? How's school? Fine. What classes have you had so far? Spanish, history, science, and English. Wow. What's your favorite class? Six hour. Six hour? What's, what is that? Study skills. You like study skills the best? No, yeah, I don't know anything. What's your other favorite? What's your favorite subject that you learn? History. You like history? That's good. We're gonna go to Rizzo's. Oh, yeah. We're gonna meet mom there. Yeah. Is that okay? Sure. Alrighty. Got our pizza. That's Dad's. Mason's, what did you get? Mm. True. What's in it? Mm. He doesn't know. Coffee. Mom, what did you get? This is the custom order. What's on it? Pesto, tomatoes, artichoke, basil. Looks pretty good. Paul's looks pretty pretty um, basic, but he says it's pretty good. The party happens under the cheese. Mm. Dad, what did you get? I made my own. So I got chicken, Canadian bacon, bacon, mushrooms, two kinds of cheese, peppers. Yeah. Very good. Mine's barbecue sauce with cheese, chicken, onions, and... I think that's it. It's pretty good though. Yeah, I love onions. Like if they're warm. We just got home. Um, we just went and looked at some venues. We looked at two barns. Um, I took clips of both of them. So the first one. This is the first location. It's a nice white barn. What it for? When she's gonna be back, no, we'll text her next time. Uh, and then the second one. 
You did? We did. Yeah. Do you live close to Pine Hill? Yeah. This is beautiful. We live close to Pine Hill. This is like. I'm going to learn and ask somebody. Maybe like somebody's like in this place. We can ask them questions. And what are their plans for like out here? Yeah. It's really nice thing to do. Like only, only drive. Both are really pretty. They both have pros and cons. Still haven't really decided. But we're looking at one more location tomorrow, or venue. And it's not a barn, but it's like downtown on the other side of town. So we're gonna look at that third one tomorrow and then we need to make a decision pretty soon. So, yeah. basketball game and we performed halftime. She killed it. Great facials, super sharp. Her toe touches were great. Mom's gonna make dessert. Mom, what are we having for dessert? Nutty Buddy. Like this uh, Muddy Buddy called? stuff. No. What's it called? No, I'm not gonna, no. It's called Better Than Sex Chex Mix. Can you confirm or deny that? I've never had it, so. Ooh. We'll let you know. She'll confirm later. <laughs> and Paula are making the Chex Mix. It's going pretty good so far. Right, Paul? Right. You know how many of the bar those things that gives you more of a, that's why those bigger measurements are going That's what we have going so far. Got some caramel, some chocolate chips, some whipping cream. Really, I don't know what could go wrong. Best cup of coffee. We have some sort of mixture going in the microwave. We'll keep you updated how it goes. Okay, so I just went and picked up the cookies that we ordered to give to my bridesmaids. And they look so cute. I'm about to show them to my sister, my sisters. Emma and Riley. Emma's gonna be my maid of honor. Riley's gonna be one of my bridesmaids. And I'm about to give them to them. And I'm gonna just give them to the rest of my friends tomorrow or just mail them to them. But this girl made them for us and she put them in like these really cute boxes and tied them up with a ribbon. It's hard to see the cookies on the inside. But there's cookies in there that say like their name and say, will you be my bridesmaid? And I'm gonna give them to them. I just need to find the ones that have their name on the inside. Your hair is like, It's the tossel. It's and it's the fact that it's I redid it. It's the too, I'm telling you. I said that to Caitlin every time it's tossel. This is for Rayleigh. Why do they Caitlin, get a present? for you guys. Why do you get off them? Are you nervous? There's no way you know. I can see, see it. it. You can just really open cool. it up, look. Open Are you kidding me? Hold up your answer. <laughs> it's one yes and one, one no. <laughs> one for two. That's too bad, especially since you're supposed to be the maid of honor too. <laughs> she, won she meant for yours. To yours say. is supposed to say maid of honor, but I forgot to tell her, so it says well, bridesmaid. I didn't know there was no two. I, I, oh, I didn't know there was no two. I didn't know that was an option. Where does it say your name on it? Look how cute that is. Those are dorbs. They're as long as I don't have to speak. You have to speak at my rehearsal <laughs> dinner. Kim, I'm not going to. Yeah, you are, and you're oh gonna cry. God. I'm not going to speak. Do you feel special? Because originally Kim said, we don't, we don't need to get one for Emma and Riley. Oh, thanks. So I would save a couple bucks. <laughs> 
Welcome to Cooking with Caitlin, part two. It's the next day we're making Mighty Buddies now. How's the idea? He's mixing the um, chocolate peanut butter. I'm mixing the Chex. It's a little different than last night's treat, but a little bit the same at the same time. You're all crushed up. Dinner? What? I haven't seen it like that. Oh yeah. Oh. <laughs> What's up guys? What's up guys? We're back. Me and Powell's vlog channel. Just tell them we finished the Muddy Buddies and how they ended up tasting. Me and Powell just made these Muddy Buddies together. They're pretty good, right? Yeah, pretty good. Yeah, um, freaking liberal, <laughs> For the, let's do a, a large fry, please, with a large Coke. Don't you hate liberals? Yes. Stop. And that's it. Can uh, get a McDonald's bacon McDouble? With all my friends. I'm 49. And hello. You're up. I don't want anything. Um, let's do a. Just in the drive-thru, having so much fun. Just um, my pants. Paul just pooped his pants. Chocolate shake. <laughs> no one breathes. And, and, and a. If you know it's good for you. Oh. If you know it's good for you. Quiet, guys. I'm ordering. Smell. Like, just breathe. Um, let me see what are on the deals real quick. If I can get a. Gross. Let's do a medium. Fry. What did you eat? Right. Oh, what uh, is? Small chocolate shake. Alright, see you guys next time. <laughs> Bye!